quickly, whoever, two or three of you want to take it, and that is research. Uh, were you asked to do research for your role? Did you have to do research for your role? Do you not do research for your role? Is it a method thing or what? Anybody want to ooh, jump ooh, on this? Ooh, Angie. Ooh, okay. <laughs> I play a, a, a Boston homicide um, investigator, and I went to Boston, and the city of Boston was kind enough to let me hang and run with their homicide unit. And I went to crime scenes, and I mean, we had a guy that, can I say what, uh, okay. So we had a guy in a car, and they, you know, you can't take a body out of a car without a search warrant. Well, if this is on a Saturday, you've got to wait for a judge to wake up and do their thing and sign the stuff. And I mean, so everyone's just standing around in the rain with this dead guy in a car who's been shot in the throat and he's slumped over. Well, his foot is on the brake, so they can't move the car. They have to pick it up with a crane. They've got it tarped so nobody in the city can see what's happened. They put it on a flatbed. It was raining. It could not have been more perfect. It was like it was it was a it was a scene. I was like, we should be shooting right now. We put a camera over there and a camera over there. It's genius. <laughs> we get um, into the station. They take it down to the garage, and they they had to sort of let gravity take effect of the truck, so it would just bounce down because the guy's foot was on the brake. I mean, the brake lights were still on. He'd been dead for four hours. So. It's not fascinating to anyone else, is it? No, it is. Oh, I'm completely fascinated. Here's the best part. So they, they, they get it in, and the, pass, the, the driver door is closed, and there's blood leaking out onto the ground because this man is just bled out in like 32 seconds. In the, but like, that's how much blood was in the car. I mean, they let me get in, get in there. Like, you, you can't touch anything. Everything is so, you don't want to mess anything up. You, you don't want to do anything because, and this is somebody's loved one. This is somebody's father, somebody's son. Loved and that's one. rare. They don't just let actors usually do No, that. no, 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 no. And so, I mean, like, you know, we're, you're standing there, and here's this man. I mean, he got up two hours ago, and I was like, this guy took a shower, and all the cops were like, well, maybe not. <laughs> And it's so funny because they're so real and they're so genuine and they've been around death and all these like horrible murders and things for so long that they develop this sort of shell and there's this great sense of humor about it. So here's this poor dead man and you know, and, and you're like, oh, wow, sad. And they're like, nah, oh, it's really not. Well, that does, does, <laughs> like, did, 